Hello, good morning. Well, actually, I'm recording this in the afternoon, which is not typical of me, but um, I haven't posted a video. I think by the time I post this video, it's going to be two weeks since I posted it. Sorry for the In 600 down. feet, turn right onto Florida 822. And you might be hearing a GPS. Sorry. The GPS is because I'm on my way. Turn right onto Florida 822. Oh, Street. And I'm on my way to a maternity dress rental store just because in about a month so um october 29th i have my maternity photo shoot and i don't have a dress to wear to it so there are a few local um places that rent dresses like long gowns or whatever for specifically maternity um so I'm gonna go check it out to see, one, what they have, what their pricing is, because if they're on the expensive side, then Amazon is gonna have to be the option because I don't feel like paying an arm and a leg to use a dress for a two hour photo shoot. Um, so yeah, and the photo shoot is, I'm actually renting at a studio, I guess it's called, but it's kind of like a house, but they like convert it into like a photo studio. Um, and I'm doing it there instead of doing it at the photographer's uh, personal studio, just because um, I want to do the milk bath. And I think the milk bath is, milk bath is so pretty. And um, the, uh, my photographer doesn't have a bathtub and I don't want to do my photo shoot out at a park or like some waterfall and I know like down south deeps down south somewhere in Miami there's like really pretty um, areas where there's like waterfalls and there's a place called like secret garden that a lot of people take pictures um, at but I don't want to do that because everyone does that and I don't want to do the same thing that everyone else does so I'm excited I'm excited to do something different and like for example my engagement photo shoot I found a photographer at the time she's no longer in business but she did um, she was specialized in retro photos so she did like 1950s she would do um, what is it called boudoir I don't know how to say the word um, like pinup beautiful pictures so that's kind of like what I'm going for now where Again, I wanted to just be, I just wanted to look classic, like classy. Um, I don't want a bare belly photo shoot. Um, I don't know what my belly's gonna look like, but I'm not a fan of showing, of showing my belly like that um, for me, like while pregnant. Um, so I'm looking for a long gown I'm like out of breath if you have not noticed <laughs> so I'm looking for a really pretty long gown and then I want Matt to wear like a nice long sleeve button down with um, black pants so very formal very pretty um, you know I like and then I'll do a, a outfit change or a dress change he'll stay the same but then I'll wear my like a lace outfit or a lace dress so I can do the milk bath um so yeah I'm on my way now to try on dresses I'm hoping that there's something that's that I really like um and yeah hopefully I can take some pictures maybe I'll try to take pictures while I'm in the in the fitting room um and if I can then I'll go ahead and post pictures and let's see how it goes okay so I just got out of trying on the dresses and I'm not sure how I feel about them. The prices were actually really good. Um, the lady was like, oh, uh, we have like a special now where it's like four dresses for $100. So I was like, oh, that's, that's actually pretty good, but I don't need four dresses. I tried on a few dresses. Here are a few. Um, like I said, I didn't want any bare belly but I do 
like lace. I think lace is very pretty. Um, she had a the uh, like the tutu or tulle skirt, but you can tell it was like handmade because um, it was like an elastic band, and then she like knotted the tulle to it. Um, so I didn't really like the way that looked, just because you can see like all the knots. Um, and then it obviously looks like it's been worn like a ton of times. Um, so some spots where it, you, it could, you can tell that it's been used. So it's not like a nice clean white. Um, some parts look almost grayish and then other parts look more white. So I might even just buy on Amazon a tool skirt that I've already seen. I've already uh, looked on Amazon just to get an idea. So I might just do that and they obviously have lace gowns so I might do that then I tried on what oh there was like some other ones there was one that was like a pretty pink and it had like pretty lace but then again like it was like that that stretchy material and two like the dress was like big it was like very loose on me she's like oh you could put clips on it and blah 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 and I'm like yes absolutely I could I, you know, I've taken photos before and I've seen it, I've done it, what they've pinned it, but she was like, I could put clips on it. Um, but my thing is like, I don't want the clips to accidentally show up in the photo. You know what I mean? Like the photo that I want, like I want like side photos. I don't want only like straight photos. So where you're going to see the clip, chances are you're probably going to see the clip. So I was just like, no. And then again, you can see the, the dip in my butt cheeks that's I don't think that's cute so that was probably a, that's a no-go but the dress overall was kind of pretty I liked it I do like you know the off the shoulder very pretty I do like sleeves um, just because I think I'm starting to become you know unfortunately this is this is totally honest I'm starting to become insecure with how my arms are are looking because you know I am gaining probably more weight than I should be um so my arms are i can already tell my arms are already getting too big um so i don't want like like my, i don't know i just don't want like this back part to show too big so you know i hate that i'm feeling insecure already but that's that's the honest truth then i tried on the blue dress that's like tulle and then it was lace at the top and even though it was blue, she said she's, oh, she has, um, she's having that same dress made, but in all white and in all pink. So she, I was like, I'll just try it on to see like how it looks on me. It's a cute dress, but that specific one seemed a little big and it, I feel like it made me look bigger, but it also does not, uh, accentuate the belly. So because of the tool and my belly is I'm six months, so my belly's not like super massive. With the tool, it's covering up my belly, and the whole point is to, you know, kind of like highlight the belly. Um, you know, I don't want to show my bare belly, and that dress actually it opens up in the front, but you know, I had it covered. I didn't, I didn't have it open. Um, so I, I don't want to accentuate my belly by showing it bare. I want to accentuate it by you know having like a tight fitted uh dress you know lace or whatever so at this point um i'm gonna show matt and my mom what i tried on to see what their thoughts are and maybe i won't even use go like actually rent through them and since i already have an idea of kind of like what the dresses may look on me i try to find it on amazon or some other website um and see and hope and pray that it fits me the way I want it to and by the end of the month so oof, I'm kind of nervous about that so we'll see but yeah that's that's just what my day was like I mean not even day just like the last hour um but let me know in the comments which one you like the most do you, do you think i should wear all pink should i wear all white should i do a combination of white and pink no tool lace no lace like let me know what your thoughts are okay guys until next time bye